Hello. It's access granted, Nate. We're no, back. It's no. you. It's team. me, the original and best you team. You guys. And we had a we had a week off because it was a bank holiday. Yep. Sorry which about that. Uh, doesn't really make Some that much sense angry. on the internet, does it? No. I guess, or bank maybe holiday. in America. Definitely not or in maybe America. Anywhere apart from England. Yeah, exactly. Where but we I was enjoyed the bank holiday. It was great. Yeah. I had a really lovely time. Thanks very much. But we're back now, so you know, don't don't worry. We're back with all the usuals, Nate. Mm -hmm. And I mean all the <gasps> usuals. I know, right? We've got. Season two Z of one on one Z. <laughs> and people didn't believe it, but there are stingsies. There's a stingsies. For everything. Yeah. Please. Some people wish there weren't stingsies. I know. But we'll come on to that. We've got we season two of one on one Z. Yes. We've got the 301 Club. Mm -hmm. We've got comments of the week. But first. The time for truth is nearly here. Bringing tales of lies and fear to stand a chance at gaming heaven. Reveal to us your game confession. Gaming confessions, not squad goals. Gaming confessions. Yeah. Just when you thought there was this thing that people might hate less than squad goals. Yeah. Some of them hate it more than that. I think most people do. From what I've been reading, and I've been reading lots. Dave's made it, by the way. Let's start with Nathan Davies, straight off the bat. Confession. I love the confessions part of these videos so much, I watch them and then turn the episode off to watch a different one. Thanks, man. Thanks, man, yeah. They, I mean, there's more good stuff in this show, right? Maybe we should timestamp the other good stuff yeah. in the description. Or we could put the confessions at the end. Uh -huh. That would screw you, wouldn't it? We that haven't done that. Yeah. <laughs> but we <laughs> next, next week, time. maybe tune in, although you just probably won't tune in. But let's move on to some actual gaming confessions. Only a few this week. Okay. Because I was really excited. Last time Holly and I did uh, Axis Granted, we were sort of lamenting the fact that there are very few just comments anymore. Right. Uh, and really? this, this, yeah, just, just all gaming confessions. About no, right, I see what you're saying. On, on Nexus Granny. Yeah. But this, so this time I've redressed the balance a bit and there's some good comments. So only a few gaming confessions. Let's get down to business with uh, Nutty Boyization. Yeah. Who okay. says, gaming confession. When I was younger, I tricked my parents into buying me Assassin's Creed 2 by convincing them that it was educational and that everything was historically accurate. Oh, it is. Which. Do you know what though? I've just come back from Rome where I was playing Uncharted 4, mm -hmm. the greatest game of the year. Yes. And it was very, people were joking about how Assassin's Creed 2 had enabled them to like find their way in the city, which, you know, that is a joke. But obviously, recognizing all the like monuments and stuff. Yep. I think people were heavily referring to Assassin's Creed 2 rather than just any sort of education they'd had. I think that's true. And I think uh, the Assassin's Creed series might bring through figures from history. Yeah, but I think if you rely upon it for a blow-by-blow -blow account of what happened in the past, yeah, you may come across. That's where I get a little bit hazy. Yeah, we should we do a video that's think. like the world as according, according to, to video games because it's it's probably pretty different. It's never been done. Let's do it. I know it's a completely new idea. Diego Quintero, gaming confessions. I've started my MGS game. I've started every MGS game, right. but I haven't actually finished them. Wow, which well, that's I one up can for relate me because I have started none of them. <laughs> And also finish kind of thing. I I really can relate to that. I think I've started Metal Gear Solid one. Dude, you know, I, I understand which ones were in the series. Metal Gear Solid two. Right, but I did actually, I did finish Metal Gear Solid two. Okay, what about number three? Three I've never played. Okay. Four I started. Some variety. And five I've started. Right, but that's so, quite a big game. I guess I'm doing one better, apart from I haven't played three, so that kind of balances out finishing two. I'm glad but, we had this conversation. Yeah. Glad yeah. we checked in. That I think I think that you know you'd be surprised how many people are in the same boat. Mason Collins, gaming confession: When mm. I play online hockey ultimate team, I right. make sure everyone is on the Wi-Fi, so it lags terribly, and my opponent quits in rage, and I get the win. Hashtag got to oh make God. Division One somehow. What? I kind of respect. just being good at hockey. I kind of respect that. That's like an old school cheat. How do you make like sure everyone's on the Wi-Fi? I don't know. Just guys, you know the Why don't you? You see, you see this amazing video. You on need YouTube? to stream this couple of hours long Surely video. Surely the game is bad for him then as well. Surely it's like no fun. Yeah, it's just. I guess the fun is just winning. Right, of course. Making yeah. people so angry that they quit. Imagine if they. But when they're not angry, they probably just win. I imagine that guy being Canadian as well, because just Canadians really like hockey. Yeah. And I thought Canadians were nicer than that. We've got no proof that he is Canadian. Just I so, know. Just so well, you know. <laughs> you know. Good. <laughs> Take that, Canada. Right, Craig Carver, Gaming Confession. This is the last one this week. Okay. One time I turned on a second controller while my friend was playing Dark Souls. I switched them while he was in the bathroom and controlled his character from behind him. He panicked because I kept mimicking his controller until he was near a ledge and made him jump off every time. <laughs> Which is just uh, horrible. 
That's a in weird Dark form Souls. of digital puppetry. Yeah. Dark Souls where you're it's so afraid enough, of death man. all the time. Exactly. And the environmental deaths are maybe the most painful. Describe them as upsetting. your friend, but I'm not sure he was your friend. Are you still friends? Yeah. I don't know. So, the Game of Confessions this week. Short but sweet. Um, but, you know, I still enjoyed it. Keep them rolling in. Yeah. If you've got anything to, to get off your chest that you've done in a game or related to a game that you feel ashamed about. And yeah. That you need to tell everybody. <laughs> maybe this will be, you know, nice and helpful. It'll help you. Or maybe it'll just be on. public embarrassment. Maybe funny, yeah. It's time. It's time. It's time. It's time for comments of the week. So comments of the week. It's good that you don't have to sing that anymore. I know, I'm really, really happy about it. Although, uh, you know, I just sang it badly once and just get to play it over and over again, which is so lovely it's for short, everyone. It's short though, isn't it? Nice it is and, short, nice it is short. short. I was very keen to keep it nice <laughs> and short. So first comment this week, mm -hmm. Tamara Farmer. I stumbled onto this channel by accident a couple of months ago while watching makeup tutorials. Now I have a PlayStation and I found the love of my life, the Assassin's Creed series. Right. That's very nice Not of you, Tamara, but I just was so excited to hear that you Look. can you can make the transition from makeup tutorials Maybe to PlayStation access. Maybe we should do some makeup tutorials. You know what I mean? Like, because they're like one of the, uh, some of the top rated YouTube channels are, Absolutely. Like, just like Disney character makeup tutorials. Yeah. We could do like Nathan Drake makeup tutorial. We should get on that, Rob. Do you, do you remember when we dressed Rob up as Kratos from God of War? Well, let's show an image of that right now. Well, I don't know if we can, but <laughs> uh, let's hope so, because I've got to edit this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and, and maybe you did or didn't just see Rob dressed as Kratos. It's the same way that those those top rated YouTubers and they do like the, you know, like some of them are just, I'm going to make myself look like this celebrity and they do like, like mega contouring yeah. to give themselves it. And that was basically what we did with Rob's body. With Rob's body. <laughs> <laughs> like turning a balloon oh. into a six pack. <laughs> 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 oh, let's move on quickly. Matab Khan. Hey guys, does PlayStation have an HQ in England? I'd like to visit it someday. Um, yeah, which is just a question. It's probably a secret, isn't it? It, it does, but it's just an office. Like yeah. it's, it's not really a place you could you, you wouldn't visit. want to go there, and I don't think they would want you there no. either. So <laughs> <laughs> I think it is. I think it might be an address that's listed on, uh, you know, official like customer service forms and stuff. So you could, you know, if you've got any actual queries, you can send them through the proper channels. But yeah. Otherwise, just hit him up on Twitter. It's probably better, isn't it? It is. Yeah. yeah. I think they have, a, you know, an HQ in it in every uh, country. Do you mean what, what you mean by an HQ? Yeah. A worldwide there's, HQ. There's, there's an, an office, isn't is. there, in, in most of the countries in which they operate? Yeah. It's just an office. Yeah. I don't know what you people know. work. There. I'm trying to clear this up, and I don't yeah. think I am. It's, it's not, not like it's not it's like not a PlayStation like a, land. No, exactly. That's what I think that you're thinking. It's not like that. No, I know. don't think one of them. Unless you but know. Wouldn't that be great though? A PlayStation hand. Oh. Dave's got a plan. Yeah. Big Delson ride. I'm thinking VR. Right. I'm just. <laughs> oh, this is going to be big. It's going to be big. I'm guys. not really sure how first. these ends join up, but cool. <laughs> don't worry about that. I'll worry about the logistics. Callum Duff, when are you guys going to E3 this year? And since Rob is a dad, will he not be going? He we're, wishes. We're going when it's on. Yeah. But, I mean, that's. Uh, so we're going. I think me and Dave are flying out on uh, the 11th. Of June, which is not really long now. It's no, God, it's like really close. Four weeks, isn't it? Um, we're we're going to be attending all the, all the in, Bethesda, all the big stuff, the Bethesda conference, EA. the PlayStation conference, and then the show itself, which fills me with dread. Yeah, um, but also excitement. Yes, obviously, it's a weird mix. I don't mix. just get scared. No, and even wish I wasn't going. No, it, definitely not. Um, it's, it's quite. It can be quite physically. Um, it can be a bit of an ordeal, can't it? It's very, very tiring, but it is very exciting as well. And our plan, um, if, if for those of you, if you, if you're new to the channel or you uh, just didn't bother watching any of the E3 stuff last year, all four of us go. Uh, me, Dave, Holly, and Rob, and we make about three videos a day while we're out there, and then like we normally have enough to keep going for a week or two afterwards as well. So we basically go. We split into two teams, uh, which we, this year maybe we should call squads. Oh, yes. we could have squad oh, goals. I know, my God. Uh, and then we just go and see all of the games. We just we yeah. make appointments to see all the big games, and we go and we either play them or we have interviews with the people. Um, so we try and cover pretty much everything that you could possibly want to see about PlayStation uh, yeah. while we're out there. And then we throw it at you over like a two or three week period. Yeah. So stay tuned for that. And if there's anything you'd like us to do actually while we're out there, definitely. For this is the access granted. We always consider to be the kind of super engaged core of our channel audience, kind of the. You know. You're the 301 club of the 301 club. Exactly. Which 
You know, right, I know what you're saying. You know what I'm saying. I sort of the best uh, of the best of the best. So, this, so if you want, you know, we've never really done, and it's quite hard for us to do vlogs because uh, we're very self-conscious. Yeah, we are. Yeah, um, and we're only funny in really short bursts. But if, yeah. you know, if and there's then, anything that you'd like to see out there, then, then let us know, and we'll just probably do it exactly the we'll, same as we'll last year. We try not to fail. We'll try not to let you know. Yeah. Yeah. Let's move on. Brandon Grice, any word on if your new theme for the PS4 will be available stateside? No word as yet. I think there are. There investigations. Are, there, are mur there are murmurs yeah. in the in the wind, you know, but, but, but there's nothing, nothing concrete. No. But but you guys saying how much you want it to come over there is, is helpful. Can only be a so, good thing. Yeah. Exactly, and so if you do want it to come over there, then uh, and anywhere in the world where it currently isn't, then do let us know, and we'll do our best. Right, next up, Mark Eric Thompson, please. You can you can read that in a few different ways. Please, Marker, Marker Thompson, Marker. Marker. Thompson. Uh, yes, whichever one of you it is, I'm pretty sure it's definitely Mark. Please, can you do a recap of the Uncharted story so far? Yes. I don't have time to replay them all. Do you know, we are so good that we went back in time and already did this. Yes, we did. It's on the just channel. for you, right Marker. Uh, right now. Yeah, it's there right now. So do, uh, and it's done a bit differently. It's not just, you know, then this happened, then this happened, then this happened. It's much more scattershot and hard to follow yeah. than that. Hopefully it's more <laughs> enjoyable. But, you know, let us know. But that is there right now. Yeah, go and take a look, please. And then just get so excited for Uncharted 4. Which is worth being excited about. Let, you know. let I mean, us I'm jaded, you. but that was a good game. Oh, man. Yeah. It, it's so good. Uh, Rich Bot, having called for the stings and now seeing the stings, I prefer it without the stings. Sorry. Shut up, Rich. Rich, we don't need to hear that, man. No, that took us, like... I mean, not that long. Like, maybe <laughs> one whole day of... Yeah. And then we were, you know, we weren't working all the time. Plus, yet. you haven't seen the one on onesies thing yet. That's true, that's coming up. Same music. That's new, exciting. New video. Yeah, an actual video. So... I mean, be five excited out of ten for that one. Yeah. And then you won't be disappointed. Absolutely. Yeah. I'm going to quickly move on from that one okay. to Ollie Eastwood, who says, please say that somebody sent Dave to play the Outlast 2 demo at PAX with a face cam for the inevitable reactions. Oh, we didn't do that. No, didn't do that. And yeah. I don't intend on playing Outlast 2, I'll tell you right now. What? Are you serious? Yeah, absolutely I'm serious. <laughs> no chance. No. Have you seen the <laughs> gameplay? <laughs> Have you seen You're the game? definitely going to be playing I don't want to play it. I mean, I had no idea that you were even going to raise this flag of like, I'm well, not going to do it. Well, I wasn't. I, you are joking, right? brought this up. What do you mean? This is like joking? wrestling. This is like wrestling where like someone's like, there's no way this is going to happen at WrestleMania. No, I and know. WrestleMania, like, you know. But wrestling is pretend. No yeah. offence anybody. But, you know, this is real. This is my actual life. And <laughs> I've watched the gameplay trailer for Outlast 2 and I don't it want to play it. can't be worse than Outlast 1. Well, it looks all worse. Your fingers cut off, and then it looks was, absolutely they were horrendous. around with your gynecology. Why don't you play it, and I'll watch you play? No, because that won't be funny, will it? I don't care if it's funny. It's my life. I'm moving on. Okay, but, but no, Light Chi Man, uh, you have an inverter in your team. I thought they were no Dirty more after the Great inverter. Purge. Burn the heretic. We're Which, the originals. What do you I mean? Don't know. Like, if you were anybody. In, oh, the, no, in the olden days, yeah. and you played it. If you ever played a game on a joystick, you're you're basically an inverter, because the, like, that's the way that no, that's light not, seems. What, like you're talking about, yeah. And I I have explained. So what's that how your I, head I works? play. If I'm flying, I play inverted. Yeah. But like Pac-Man, you know, there's a joystick. Like up was you know forward was up. You lost your mind. What? Are you going down to go up? Yeah, 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 but I'm not moving. Pac I'm not moving Pac-Man's sight, am I? I'm moving actual Pac-Man. Yeah. I'm not. So I like you, if it so was a game where so I'm moving a discrete object. So you don't play that inverted. No. Right. But I don't even think it's an option. Well, what I'm no, saying but is, no, but you were saying original joystick. As a model of the human head, right? Yeah. I pull your head down to look up, <laughs> and it goes. <laughs> well, I wish you, you wouldn't. Seen, right. <laughs> <laughs> that is that is what the invert. That's what inverting is no, about. No, I understand. And everyone who doesn't do it is an idiot. <laughs> now let's move along. Well, fine. We Good. shall move along. Good. Now I've rubbed your head this and gone mad. Is, this is my favourite few comments ever. <laughs> okay. Two comments. Okay, yeah, good. It's just, it's, it's just in response to last, <laughs> the last axis granted. I don't know what it's specifically talking about. It's from Turtle Guy who says, Kring! <laughs> <laughs> they had to imply with the right spelling of Little cringe. <laughs> cringe. <laughs> Which is amazing. <laughs> like, oh, it's so man. perfect. It's so perfect. Thank I guess you, he, was probably, he probably meant the, uh, 
gaming confessions thing, didn't he? He it's maybe. Probably. I mean, th I don't care. It's so perfect. It's one of the most amazing little stories that's ever been just perfectly brought into my it's like life. A little comic book. Cring. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> cring. cring. I meant cringe. It's just oh, amazing. Can you not edit? You just delete that one. Anyway. Thanks, Turtle Guy. So last uh, last comment of the week is from uh, AZN Panda Five Ten X. Okay, that guy. Yeah, which sounds like a code name. Uh, Whoever loses on one on onesie should wear it and do SingStar every time. Now people what? will hate to lose even more. I mean, I hate losing and I hate the onesie. That's enough. Yeah. Well, it's because, uh, you know, last time on Access Quiet, someone suggested that we, we did SingStar as one of the challenges. Yeah, which, I mean, Dave, who used to be in a band and like singing, I'm not sure is a brilliant idea. Ah, mm. I'm just saying how, what a great Morrissey you do. Mm hmm. So. To is which people were going, who's Morrissey? Yeah, I know. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, that comment is last because it is time <gasps> for the next season of One on Onesie, season two -sie. Right, so we do have, we basically we've got like a load of games planned out. In future, we're going to be pulling them out of the hat. This week, there was a particular game that is, is a new release and we just couldn't not play it. And we both agreed no one had an advantage. It's, you know, it was a, it's, a, it's a party game. Yeah. It's, it's, hard. it's hard to see how you could have an advantage of this game. Exactly. This is going to be one on one. <laughs> So for the first week of the new, of season two of One on One Z, what have we agreed? This is a weird game. This is Push Me, Pull You, and it's basically a game about being a two-headed stretchy worm. Even the sound effects are just slightly horrible, aren't they? Should we tell people how, how you play really, yeah. really quickly? So it's basically, it's, it's for four players, really, but you can play it with two. And you control one stick as each kind of head of your horrible worm man. Uh, and, <laughs> <laughs> and, and you can stretch yourself out by pressing uh, the, the L2 and R2. And you can shrink by pressing L1 and R1. And I'm just uh. going to give you a big... Okay, left stick is just old man. Just wrapping you up. Left stick is old man. <laughs> okay. Get the ball in your half. That's it. It's That's easy. It. Are you ready, though? No. Let's do this, Dave. Uh, one of yes. my people have just gone. Do, 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 do. Oh, no. I've already forgotten which side is which. Why okay. are you talking about diamonds on your team? I don't know. So I'm, I've got this is my tactic. Got it off. Oh. So, yeah, if you oh. get it out of the ring like there, it doesn't oh. score any points. And whilst you're not scoring points, you're losing points. I'm going. <laughs> oh. No! Yes. No! I'm going to have this one. It's oh. too late for you. Come on, let it go, Nate. No. Let it go. Oh, you had a bumps. whole season of, of onesie wins. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's right. Now, no, something you should know is that it, it just puts the ball back at any time. Uh, I, oh, I know. <laughs> right, fine. We're gonna have to. You've made. You've brought this upon yourself. Uh, 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 oh. no, 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 They're no. not scoring points. No. Now you're talking about bombs. Come on. No. Yes. 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 Oh. What is that man doing up there? <laughs> <laughs> ah. Ah. I don't know if it scores. <laughs> More or less. Ah, no! Stop that. I need to take you out. You leave the ball. <laughs> Damn, somebody just helped you then. Get out of the ring. Here we go. That's fine. You be big. You be as Come big on, as you man. want. Come on, old man part of my... Get away from this. Now, why am I just scoring? I'm just scoring so many points for you. It's yes. absolutely <laughs> mental. Get it out. No. No! <laughs> Brute force it over. You, no. you weird sausage. <laughs> oh no! Uh, the way. It's <laughs> so it's just pencils. No! Pencils maybe. Come no! on. Yes. No! Fish. Oh fudge! <laughs> oh, so close. Oh. Come on, come on, fish lady. Ah, uh, no man. Come on, man. Come on, the man. Storms. Come on, the Talking man about part. about the weather. Come yeah, on, times. the man part. <laughs> Come on, the man part. Oh! Uh, <laughs> yes, no. Oh! No, wrong body line. Oh, yes, no. yes, yes, yes. 
Oh, damn. Oh, yeah. double no! down. Yes. Just, no, oh, he's turned it around. He's won the game for me. Damn oh, it. that's the game. That's the game. That's the game right there. Should we try it? We could try a different variant. Well, no, let's let's uh, do the same. But Dave, come with me. Dave, this way. Oh. You've gone outside the zone. Really? What's this? Now we're dogs! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's the, how it descends now. It just... <laughs> Just us barking. Right, okay, right. I don't like this. I did well as men and women, <laughs> not as dogs. I've got no idea which dog's which, by the way. I don't know if you if you have any idea. I'm just sort of having to... Rough idea. <laughs> just... Could this become as big as Rocket League? Because I'm thinking I could I could become an eSports oh, shoot. major league. Look, I'm just scoring for you, man. I know. Oh, it's very kind of you. I don't need that kind of assistance because look, oh, I won. Oh, there's no way for me to get it out, is there? Oh, okay. Come no, on. come on, oh. come on, Nathan, come on. I it's just a, can't get. Look, it's like you had the whole of season one. It's like trying to one grab one here, right? soap with it's two time fingers. For me it's so hard. To take an amazing. Ah! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you're playing for pride. Is it going to be a complete whitewash? Yeah, I think it is. Six yeah. rounds. I don't know why you're so good at this stupid worm game. <laughs> It's so hard to f it's like it's like an oily little worm! <laughs> Grab the ball! That's Look at it, he had his little paw on the ball like a footballer! <laughs> this is the end. <laughs> Get the onesie! They've got the skills to know When it's time to watch our next video They're the ones we love 301 Club Better than the comments above 301 So I think Dave, the advantage that you had there is that you are basically like a two-headed worm creature Right, and, uh, okay And that was like your home turf Right, I'll that take it. It wasn't fair. It, what about the dog bit? <laughs> I don't know what happened with the dog bit. I missed this. Why did we ever <laughs> take a break? Uh, you, orange is your colour, man. been very, very busy. Well, let's remember that you wore the orange more than me last time. Yeah, so, and yeah. who knows? Let's not forget. Rob is suggesting that I need to put the hood on. You do. As tradition dictates. It doesn't really go on. It's quite, I don't know if it's shrinking. I don't know, it feels just tighter and weirder than normal. So, one on one's back where it belongs, safely on Nate's back. It's, on, it's in the PS4 theme, Nate. Yeah. It's just, just right. I didn't even mind about that. I was so magnanimous about that. You're so magnanimous. Who wants to be in the onesie? You're an amazing mind. man. I'm in the onesie as the winner of the first season. I mean, it's obvious I'm a champion. Let's not get started on the first season, all right? When I had to completely replay a whole game of something because you threw your toys out the pram. 301 Club That's time. literally what you did. 301 Club <laughs> I'm still time. Got the face. Why have you taken down the hood? Let's go. We've got three <laughs> contenders this week. Nath, you can decide who the winner is. Uh, you should see Dave when he's really good. Joe Sue Longin is first up 301 Club because I had the skills to know when to watch your next video. Which okay, I like. No well one's that gone is, that yeah. route before. No, that's And I good. wrote those words. Yeah, he did. <laughs> uh, Took Mac, who says 301 Club. I like the smell here. Which, is, which is strange. It and is. again, straight in. Oh god, yeah. I mean, this wrong. The well. smell here is <sighs> something else. It's, it's unique. about it's unique. Twelve weeks worth of man time. Man time. Uh, and Daniel Hergen Rother, who says three hundred one club one on onesie is back. Yes, yesterday was my birthday, but I'm getting my gift now. Thanks, guys. <laughs> and then, oh. Because he, <laughs> he he this was on the last access oh, Well, look, it's back now, man. And now it is back, and it's only two weeks after your birthday. This is oh, the man. best. This that is really sad. So I think he's going to have to be uh, king of All three right, or one club you this, can be, this week. Daniel, you can be king. Congratulations, birthday king boy, man. Yeah, the day that I won the one on onesie challenge again. So all that leaves, Nath, mm. is what's coming up this week. Uncharted is out. Uncharted is probably, out. It's probably quite I a think big deal. We should just leave that as the headline, isn't it? Uncharted is out. Um, please do play it. Like just I, check it out. I, it's some of the most fun I've had in playing a game for ages. You and I both finished it. Yeah. Uh, it's quite long. 
It is. You know, I, I, I finished it and I was like, so there's going to be no spoilers here, don't worry. Um, I was so like, I just, for I played it I think in three or four sessions, Yeah. long sessions, Yeah. Uh, into the night most of the time. And when it was done, you know when you've got a game that you just love and you want to come home and play it and you're know, like, I, sometimes I don't have that much time to play games, so it's only really, you know that weird thing about how hard it can be sometimes to get into a game? Yeah. You're like, I want, I paid for this game, I want to play this game, yeah. why can't I get into it? Um, and this, I was just in. This you know? is the opposite. And then as soon as I, as soon as like it was over, I was like, in my head, I was like, gonna go home. And then like I think, what are you gonna do when you get home? And be yeah. like, I don't know, I finished it, haven't I? So I started basically. I, I started the um, right, the collection. HD collection, which I didn't have time to play before. But I just like I just need more Uncharted. It's one of those games where I, I you know, when I was when I was hadn't finished it yet, I was coming to work and just thinking. What I just I want to play it now. I want to play it now. What's going to happen next in the story? What's going to happen? And just it's just amazing. That's the mad thing, isn't it? Because you and I both really enjoyed the story, and that's what powers you through that first play. Yeah. You just want to like I just want to know what happens, and maybe to the point where maybe I didn't really appreciate. I mean, there were some points where I was just like, well, this looks just stupidly good. Like, yeah. Uh, it's, That's most of the point. It's, it is like, to my eye, the best looking game on PlayStation 4 by like a bit of a margin. Yeah. Um, and man, I mean, I mean, I guess if there were, you know, maybe I should just go back and play it and just be a bit slower. Use the old photo mode. We were thinking about doing a video actually where we did like our holiday album from Uncharted 4 because we both spent quite a lot of time just messing around in photo mode. Yeah. Um, so if you don't want that, then speak up. Otherwise, we'll assume everybody does. <laughs> Everyone's watched right to the end of the video and has just said yes to that. Yeah. So, so let's know. Um, so pick up Uncharted 4 and play it immediately. And uh, and obviously there's the uh, the multiplayer mode, which the servers haven't come on yet for us, so we haven't had a chance to play that. But I'm no. looking forward to that, and that's a great reason to get back in. Uh, and we've had our Uncharted sort of the story so far video, uh, which came out earlier today, mm -hmm. which you should watch first. Uh, Rob's got another Friday feature. We've got the store. And um, I'm pretty sure that there's going to be something else that rears its ugly head that we have Almost as certainly. yet unseen. Well, if there's anything that's been out lately that you've wanted us to play, we've been like we've been pretty busy putting all the Uncharted stuff together over the last week or so. so a, a few games have come out. Obviously, Push Me, Pull You was a game we couldn't say no to. But if there's no anything way. else that we've kind of missed, give us a shout out. We'll see if we can do a quick gameplay video this week as well. Yeah. So other than that, all that's left to say is uh, thanks for watching Access Granted this week. Um, please do keep commenting. We love to hear from is you. The, if you don't comment, the show gets even worse. It really so. does. <laughs> <So> <laughs> it's, it's important that you tell us as many things as you can. Yeah, let us know your gaming confessions. Like this video if you liked it and do subscribe and tell others to su subscribe. So Share that we can, about. we can get stronger and stronger and, and one day like can a be... Wave. Sort of maybe, you know, a plague on humanity or something. That would cool. be good. Yeah.